Hello! In this video we will see how to create this medicine symbol using Rhino Emboss. All these curves was, were previous, previously created and grouped as you can see and now the idea is to use all these curves to define the reliefs. So let's start with Rhino Emboss. First I can define the project measures. Let's adjust in here. Seems fine. Cap type, resolution. I can adjust everything. And the idea now is to select a new operation in this side panel to start defining all the reliefs. So I'm going to start with the extrude operation type and the curve will be the outside curve. So it's already grouped with this inside one, so now I just need to define the extrusion distance, in this case 0.5, let's see, refresh, ok, this is the result. In here, if I want to keep the holes, I just need to go to operation settings and define under this icon to keep the holes and refresh. As you can see, it was successful created and now I'm going to add one more operation operation type by profile and the curves I'm going to select this group and the gumball you can adjust the 8 2 millimeters refresh let's see the results okay seems good and now one more operation by profile and the curve this one's from the wings also 2 millimeters 8 and refresh to check the results okay easily we can define the reliefs as you can see so one more operation by profile and define this group and refresh. In this case we can adjust the 8 of the profile. Let me double click and define 2 millimeters. Adjust this and refresh. OK. So now I'm going to add one more operation by profile. This is the curve. Refresh, maybe adjust a little bit more. One more operation by profile. I keep this profile. So I select the curve, this one. Just profile, not the correct one. So remember, we can hide the profiles in this icon and if press shift all the profiles so in this case I want to keep this one let me adjust profile refresh okay this is the idea really really easy one last operation by profile for the eyes and in this case I'm going to adjust the gumball under the operation settings to be subtract. So when I refresh, it will subtract from the previous operation. OK, I can hide the gumballs. And now one last operation, but this time operation type smooth. So I just need to adjust the diameter and smooth the results. As you can see with the smooth we can have better surface results. Really easy. We can adjust the diameter. Also the smooth level but in this case I'm going to keep this one and easily we can define everything. Okay, 
Now I'm just going to turn off the smooth operation, refresh again, and it seems perfect. So now I just need to check here and Rhino Emboss will calculate to add this mesh to the document. Before adding the mesh, Rhino Emboss will, will open the decimator to reduce, it allows us to reduce the mesh resolution. Let's take a look. This is the decimator, so in here we can see the model, we can reduce, let's try 60%, so this allows us to save the, in the file of file size so easily we can check the results. In this case, just going to keep the original 100%. And this is the idea. I just need to check here. Okay, and the mesh was successful created. So just change the display mode. We can see the back rendered. So a flat back bottom and this is the results. Really, really easy. I hope you like it. Thanks for watching.